Hi guys, this is a video on Windows software. This time I'm talking about unlocking processes that are using your files. For example, if I was to try and delete Derek's boot and nuke.iso, now I know that my virtual CD is using it and it's in my it's pretending it's in my drive. So if I try and drag this to the recycle bin, as you can see it does nothing. And it says cannot delete Derek's boot and nuke. And also I'm uploading a video to YouTube. Um, which is the one I've just made on um, securing, securely deleting files. So if I drag this into Recycle Bin, you'll notice that says exactly the same. Count delete source is being used by another person or program. Now, uh, this irritated me, so I, there is a piece of software that you can get called Unlocker, and basically all you have to do is right click the file, choose Unlocker, and you can see that it comes up with a dialog box and it tells you that it says that my path is locked for my file it's got two here uh, usually it has one it may be because it's using it's using my program that puts it into um, uh, into the my computer or something but either way you can either kill the process that's using it or you can unlock them so if I was to say unlock all it's now gone and now if I try and delete it I can now delete it fine which is great. Now I'm going to try secure.avi which is what I'm uploading to YouTube. Use unlocker. I'm not going to actually delete this because it will kill the process in YouTube. So it says the process using it is firefox.exe and it says the path to my file and it says the process path which is C programs Firefox. So I can either kill Firefox that's using it or I can unlock the file and I can delete it. So you you may find like with the previous one I show you it wasn't technically using a program it was just being emulated in my my computer that's why it said system because one of the system processes was making it emulate it into my computer so if you have anything that's using like actual processes that are open for example my Firefox it will come up with the process so uh, that's about it really a very short video showing you on if you have um, files that end up having sharing violations or anything like that you can use Unlocker. Uh, obviously that won't work now but you can use unlocker to unlock your processes or kill your processes so you can move or do anything that you want with your files so thanks for watching my video um, please comment rate subscribe if there's any piece of software better than this than you know please let me know and if you like my videos subscribe and thanks again